Hey, welcome to lesson five in this series. If you haven't watched the first four video lessons, I would encourage you to do that because they build on each other so that you can learn this complete riff and learn all the licks that go along with it. And before I show you the ending part of this, I want to let you know that if you're into the blues, I have an easy blues guitar video lesson over at yourguitarguide.com. And I'll leave the link in the description for that. So if you like this style of teaching, then check that out. Now for this video lesson, I've got the tab. That'll also be in the description. So let's continue along. First, let me show you what we've got so far, and then I'll show you the ending of it. Here we go. That's what we're going to learn right here. If you don't know the pentatonic scale or the blues scale, check out the video right here. We're starting on 5 on the D string, the 4 string, and we're sliding to 7. And we're going to 5 on the D string, 7 on the A string, the 5th string, and we're going six, five, three, all on the A string, and then sliding with your third finger from five to seven. And then five, three, all on the A, and then five on the six string. So it's, it's five on the D string, slide to seven, back to five on the D string, Seven on the A string, the fifth string. Six on the A string. Five, three, all on the A string. Then third finger, five, seven, five, three, five. So it's. important you use the right fingers or you'll get all twisted in there so it's third finger five to seven on the D string five on the D string seven on the A the rest of the notes are on the A until we end on the fifth fret of the E string so it's seven six five three five to seven slide five three end on the E So you can take and play these licks by themselves and the riffs, or you can play it all together like this. Don't forget to get the tab for this over at yourguitarguide.com and the link is in the description below. If you like this lesson, can you give it a thumbs up? Leave me a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Let me know what you think. And if this is your first time here, consider subscribing for more guitar tips and tricks. And watch that lesson next. Thanks. Stay safe.